Hi everyone, it's Nisha. So today I am going to try to recreate the look that I had on in my latest wig reviews. You all liked it. And this is the first time I did it. I just sat down one morning and played with the Urban Decay Born to Run palette with all the greens. And that's what I came up with. So I hope I can remember how I did it. <laughs> Okay, so first I'm going to use Reef and I'm going to go with it in my crease, not all the way um, into the inner corner, just three quarters of the way. And just blend it out upwards. So when you add a bit of eyeshadow, you start in a crease, deposit the most of it in a crease and then blend out the rest with not adding any more eyeshadow. Now I'm going to use the Big Sky and start shading the outer seven, pulling it a bit into the crease. And I'm going to put it in my inner corner just a slightly bit. And then connect that green just in a crease. Don't go here in the middle with it. Now I'm going to use the Wanderlust and just darken this outer seven with it. but I'm not adding it in, a, in this inner corner. Then I'm going to use the radio and again shade the outer V or outer seven, pull it a bit into the crease just at the top, blend it a bit I get a bit of fallout, I take like really clean brush and very gently brush it off. I don't like smudge it, but you know, it's probably better not to have foundation on when you do your eyes, but I hate that. <laughs> then go back to that brush with Reef and just blend the edges. Now I'm going to take Stranded, which is gold, and I'm going to apply it right in the middle and just go a bit over this way, over that green. It is almost like a halo look. And I'm gonna drag it into the inner corner over a bit of that green that I put in at the beginning, just a slight. So that green sticks poke up, still poke, pokes out from underneath, but it's mostly gold. I'm going to go back to radio and just gently tap it, try to Blend it out 
the edges between the gold and the green. Okay, now on uh, my bottom lash line, I'm going to use a Kiko Intense Color Long Lasting Eyeliner in 08. I just find it that if you're using like a bit more colorful eyeshadow, it sticks better to a pencil, otherwise sometimes can go all over the place. So I am going to apply it to about here. Then I'm going to apply on the top of that on top of that big sky, which is this one. I am going to darken this with the radio. And I'm going to make sure that I now really blend it. I'm taking Stranded, the gold one, and apply it in a, in a corner, overlapping that green one a bit. Then take the brush that I had the riff on without any eyeshadow and just blend it all out a bit underneath. Now I'm going to apply a bit of coal liner on my top lash line. Now I'm going to apply mascara and I think in that video I also had false lashes so I will do that and I will be back. And this is the finished look. The lashes I have used are um, from EXO Beauty and these are called the Fan Girl. Um, I really like them. I like spiky type of eyelashes because when you have hooded eyes if you get like really thick curtain eyelashes you can't see really the eyeshadow through it so I like spiky ones and I've just found these and I really like them I had to just trim off the last section on the outside um, and that's it my lipstick is a bit too pink I think I brought the wrong lip liner down here it was a bit too pink uh, but the lipstick and the gloss is exactly the same um, I just should have used a bit more nude liner but everything will be linked below so that's the finished look. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and stay fabulous. Bye.